Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your boy Awam Kenneth and if you're new here, make sure you subscribe. And if you have been here for a minute and you haven't subscribed, like why are you cursing poverty? <laughs> so I want to document something, um, a process I'm going through. Although I really wanted to do more location-based videos but it has been raining cats and dogs here in Jos and it's almost August so I don't know like it's always shifting and spoiling plants but nonetheless we're gonna get to it and I have been uh, ill for a little bit anyway so I have come to the end of like my first two months teaching a seven-year-old boy computer and i just embarked on this journey just to see like how it would be imagine like you know when you go to school and they say how many of you would want to be a teacher in the future and everybody's like basically no because we're busy trying to be engineers doctors lawyers or um, what do you call it neurosurgeons you know during the days of ben carson and now here am i left school teaching a seven-year-old boy computer pretty amazing to be honest like i mean he taught me like patience he taught me because you have to explain things to um yeah i'm saying yeah to his understanding so really teach you patience really teach you something that i felt like embarking on this journey would basically be me getting the skill that i might need in the future and I feel like I got that. Although I might end up teaching him more as um, the month goes by. Uh, I think he's trying to like resume school for now. And then after a few days into resumption, we might get back at it. But so far, that has been awesome. And they have the most amazing garden in Plata State. I mean, the, the most amazing house garden. Like the trees, they are awesome. And why I decided to like end back on this was I had just left the job and I was like doing nothing and I wanted to learn Android. I will get into that for in a little while. I wanted to learn Android and I was like, while I'm learning Android, let me just like have something that keeps my pocket refresh, clean, not smelly, like going. And I was like, oh cool, I could teach computer. I love computer, I always loved computer and it's a fantastic opportunity to teach a seven-year-old boy computer and also felt like the skills that we get from teaching this boy computer i could use it in the future one day like only god knows right so but what i found out was like it really taught me a lot of patience a lot of like calm down because i'm always like fast 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 like calm down slow your rule and explain things like even communicate like that was something I really found interesting. I'll be out here thinking that everybody knows what I really know. So using words like that he doesn't know definitely. And I'll be assuming like, why don't you know this? You know, and I keep forgetting that he's a seven year old boy. And it was really interesting. So I learned a lot about like how to communicate, how to be patient, how to explain it's a part of communication, how to also be creative. You get it. Like things he does on his own without me teaching him certain things on the computer, like his understanding, his ability to understand something and go through his, uh, like say, use his curiosity to find out the rest was really mind blowing. It was like I was rediscovering computer all over. And the second part of this video was for me to just tell you guys about Andela. So Andela partner with Google and ProSight and they're doing, um, like say, training course for Africans on subjects, on three subjects, Android, um, mobile web, and cloud. So I picked Android, of course, because I have some history with Android and I really wanted to be in-depth in Android. And I have a particular app that I have been creating for like almost two years now. And it got stalled because I don't know Android in detail. Like, and how to use templates i'm an expert in copying code but like for me to like hand code 
as you dive in the word, for me to like properly code the software from scratch to finish is non-existent. So that's why I'm learning it. And it's been a couple of months and it's almost coming to the end. And I think this is the end of phase one. And if I get lucky, I don't know if I get lucky, but is there luck? We're meant to do hard work and we're putting work again into this. I, I'm sure I should be entering the next phase because I've committed some time and I've really put in a lot of effort into this and I just hope I get into the next phase and after that, I write the exam and pass. And but that is not really my problem. My main goal here is to actually know this language and make something useful of it. So it's not like a certificate point, although it would be very, very good for me to have like a certificate to finally show some people that, hey, how you doing? I have a certificate, so keep quiet, don't ask me any more questions. But yeah, so that's like the journey so far. It's been really interesting, like learning Android, like watching tons and tons of videos which is required for you to pass this training, right? You need to, and they give a little bit of projects in here and there. So I've done the first project, it was really cool. I think I might try to add it in this video, but if I don't add it due to laziness, just know that. Anyway, it's been fun and I just want to like make this video to document this process, um, which is like coming to an end simultaneously on the same day. Yeah. So, Bye, guys.